I'm not gonna pretend like I planned this video at all. I literally just jumped out of bed. It is 6.11. I was supposed to be doing work. And I was just like, I'm filming a video. I don't even give a shit. And I'm not going anywhere. I'm not doing anything. But I was like, let me get glam for absolutely no reason. So whatsoever. So I was like, yes, go me. Go me for trying to make myself feel better about my life and film a video. Let's get into the video. I'm gonna moisturize whatever. I look so disgusting, my god. I'm in my pajamas. Like, these are my pajama bottoms. Just had a shower this morning when I got up. When I say this morning, I mean like two o'clock in the afternoon because I got up at two o'clock. Put back on my pajamas. <laughs> I've been lazing in bed ever since. We're using the Garnier Moisture Protect Moisturizer. Okay, we're gonna do some aqua priming base. No point even me showing you the bottle because like all the writing dropped off. But it's the Makeup Revolution Aqua Priming Base. Ugh. Every time I look at myself in the mirror, it's like, what is going on, really? So I'm gonna do my brows. So in the car drawer, like a shit car drawer to do my brows. My eyebrows need some serious doing. I feel like I've just forgotten how to do eyebrows. Like, eyebrows never come out nice anymore. So this one always comes out bolder than this one. So pay zero attention to that. So let me prime my eyes. What I like to do is use this brush the vintage rose foundation brush i use it to prime my eyelids so not really used for what it's supposed to be used for but hey ho i've been into pretty little liars since like november because i wanted to get on the bandwagon like because everybody said it was like one of the best um series that they've watched and i have totally completely fallen in love with it like it is the best ever and I'm nearly done. I'm on season, I'm on season seven, episode twelve, I think. Um, and I need recommendations of other series to watch after I finished because I know I'm going to be so lost without it because um, I've literally been binge watching since November. A proper binge watch for like one week and then I completely miss a week and then I binge watch again. So that's why it's taken so long. I need like recommendations so please do let me know like contact me on my social media or comment down below if you know any I'm thinking about Gossip Girl so let me know your opinions on that or Vampire Diaries because I've heard a lot about Vampire Diaries as well you see when I prime my eyelids I always carve out my brows I don't know why I didn't do that one sec so we just had a mother's meeting outside. One of my flatmates have just come home from like a lad's trip. So we just had a chit chat catch up and I'm pretty sure my carved out concealer is stuck like that now. Um, and I need to change my battery, so be right back. So I'm just gonna see if I can blend out this concealer. I'm gonna set it now. I'm gonna use just a big brush. This is the Avon Magic's um, finishing powder. My eyebrows don't look anything alike, but we're gonna have to deal with that, unfortunately. Now I'm going to um, stick some sellotape on my eyes because I want to create like a wind look. I've stuck down the sellotape. Okay, so I've got the Makeup Revolution palette that is in collaboration with Soph Does Nails. Oh God, this is making my eyes water. I'm going to go in with the color Penguin first and just go all over my lid now I'm going to go in with a cup of tea in the crease I'm going to go in with pumpkin and just deepen the upper bit these eyeshadows are so pigmented I'm just going to drag it onto the side of it. Pretty now I'm orange right now. So I'm going to go in with the colour Danger and go through it again. 
to make it like a deep red colour and focus it a lot on the outer corner. One eye always goes better than the other one and it's really this eye. This eye is just not doing it for me. It should look like this. I don't know why I'm telling you it should look like this because I've never done this look before so I don't know how this is going to turn out. So, right, then I'm going to cut my crease. I'm going to use Avon Cream Concealer in Medium. I don't want to go all the way up into my crease because I still want the red to show part of it. Just set that quickly. Okay, so now I want to go in with a fluffy brush and take this Avon colour and use this yellow colour up here. I'm going to get a clean blending brush, just go through and even everything up. I'll go back in with the colour Tiramisu from the Sofa palette and just blend these two. So now I'm going to do some eyeliner. I think that'll do. Okay, so I'm gonna try and blend this out because this is appalling. Now I'm gonna do my lower lash line. So I'm gonna go back in with Danger and do my lower lash line. I'm gonna try and smoke that out with pumpkin. Oh my god, I just realised my bloody window is open. Let's show you now, actually. Okay, it's so a time for some mascara. Avon Super Extend Some Mascara. No, I'll just leave everything down below, so don't worry about that. That's my eyes done. They didn't come out too bad, to be honest. Now for some foundation. I'm gonna conceal first because. What the hell, I'm not gonna put this around my face because I've got blemishes all freaking over. Gonna put some foundation onto my thing. I'm using the Body Shop Fresh Nudes Foundation in the colour Atlas Dunes. Atlas Dunes, Dunes, but it's just freaking cool, I don't know. Dot this around my face as well. Hmm. Not too bloody bad. I'm very shocked at this current point in time to be 100% honest with you. So, oh no. Put my hand in strawberry sweet. Oh no. I need to set my face. So I'm gonna go in with the Avon Magic again. Just gonna pat it into my skin. Oh, it's going everywhere. Right, and I am at getting to my contour with the Contour Pro Fusion palette. Just do my cheekbones. Why does my eyebrow look like that? I'm just gonna have to deal with that, I can't be asked. I am using these two palettes at the end here yeah, to contour. This bronze up my forehead and my jawline. <laughs> I like to like push this together, dip it in and then do my nose. Just so that I don't have to change brushes because I am lazy. I know this bit looks really muddy here yeah, but it really does not look like in real life. I must tell you now. Let me clean my contour. So, I'm going to go back in with the powder, dip in my beauty blender, it's not even wet or anything. So for highlight, I'm going to go in with the Sleek Makeup Palette, this highlight, and I'm going to go in with the, I kind of don't want to go for the purple one, but that is my favourite, so I'm going to go in with the gold one, I think, this kind of goldy shade, champagne shade. 
I don't really use blush, so sorry if you're a blush person. You can always put it if you like. Down the nose. There. I'm just going to dip my finger into the yellowy shade and put this on the brow bone. Pretty. Okay, so let me dust off this bake. So now for lips and I will be done. So I'm going to go for like a nudie lip I think. Am I? Am I going to go for a nudie lip? I'm going to go for Marvellous Mocha in the Avon lipsticks. I've actually got only a miniature one because mum bought me all the miniature ones one year and I still haven't gone through them so I'm like, well, I might as well just use them out, so. And I want to make it even more, like, ready. So I'm going to put, like, a red. But I'm not going to, like, make, emphasise red. I think I'm going to use Supreme Red. And I'm going to add some shimmer because I'm always a shimmer. This Milani Venice um, Brilliant Shine Lip Gloss. This is amazing. This is my favourite lip gloss ever. And there we go. Let me like pretend that like, I've just dressed up and whatever. I'll just brush out this hair. I haven't brushed my hair all day. Just letting you know. If this ain't the, the most beautiful hairstyle you have you've seen in your life, I don't know what is going on with it because I love it. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video guys. I it was totally an out of the blue video and I proper enjoyed filming it like I don't feel guilty for not revising at all. Um I do have a big essay to do and I haven't started it, so I should start doing that. But I thought I needed to film a video to like get me back in the spirits i hope you enjoyed this video and i hope you like this look and if you did like it please give it a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down below have a lovely day guys